In this video, I'm going to show you a super quick and easy method to clean out your vat using your leftover supports from old prints. While this method works great for getting you quickly printing again, it's still not going to be as thorough as completely pulling your vat and cleaning it by hand, but it does work really well for cleaning up debris left from small print failures. You're going to start by placing the support in one of the corners of your vat, kind of in between the edge and the middle. Also make sure the support has been cleaned really well or it can leave additional debris in your tank. Place the support down and move it back and forth a bit, applying gentle pressure to ensure it has good contact with the FEP sheet. I don't know why I tapped it like this. Then you're going to go into your vat or tank cleaning feature and set the exposure time. You want to run it for around 50 seconds to a minute to get a strong layer. If your machine only does lower increments, just run the test a few times. I'm going to go with 50 seconds on the M5S. Side note, but this resin has been sitting in my vat for around a week, and because it was unmixed and had several different colors in it, it made this really cool, almost hypnotizing pattern that emerged from the exposure burn. When the exposure is done, you want to gently grab the support and slowly pull while tilting towards the center of the tank to release the corner. Once the layer is removed, let it drain off a bit over the tank and then remove it from the vat. As you can see here and here, the tank clean did its job and removed the debris from the failed print. I'm going to let this cure outside for a few days and see if I could salvage any of it to use for other projects. Before printing again, I always like to feel around in the vat with a rubber spatula just to make sure all the debris has been removed. If you don't feel anything, you're good to print again. If this video helped you in any way, please consider subscribing, and if you have any questions regarding the process, please feel free to comment below. I love learning and interacting with you guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next project.